Tom Tugendhat, who is believed to be in the running to replace Boris Johnson as Prime Minister, once made an unkind dig at him when he was Foreign Secretary, unearthed reports show. Mr. Johnson is so far holding on to his role as Prime Minister, but with the mounting party gate scandal, many in Westminster do not believe his premiership can last beyond May's local elections. Further anger was ignited this week after Downing Street confirmed that birthday celebrations were held for him at number 10 in June 2020, when rules banned most indoor gatherings involving more than two people. ITV News reported that up to 30 people attended the event, sang happy birthday and were served cake. But number 10 staff maintain that they gathered briefly for no more than 10 minutes. The new revelation will be another blow to Mr. Johnson's already faltering authority within his party in Westminster, with his potential successes now being floated. Among them include Chancellor Rishi Sunak, Foreign Secretary Liz Truss, Health Secretary Sajid Javid, Secretary for Leveling Up Michael Gove, Deputy Prime Minister Domingue Raab, Chair of Health and Social Care Committee Jeremy Hunt, and Chairman of the Foreign Affairs Committee Tom Tugendhat. All have legitimate claims to the top job having worked in politics for many years, each of them holding or having held senior positions in government, some have already thrown their hats into the ring in previous years, like Mr. Javid and Mr. Gove. While Mr. Tugendhat is a relative outsider to the pack and has never officially made a bid for the role, he has previously spelled out his wishes to one day become Prime Minister. In 2017. The MP for Tunbridge and Malling said during an interview with House Magazine, would it be great to be Prime Minister? Yep, it would be. Would it be great to be Foreign Secretary? Fantastic. Would it be great to be Defence Secretary? Wonderful. Would it be great to be a Minister of any kind? Yes, because all of those opportunities to serve are very much winning a lottery in what is frankly a fantastic opportunity to serve our country in a different way.